Okay, what we're going to do is, <coughs> excuse me, we're going to look at this. Okay, and this is, okay, the only way to get better from any, from it doesn't matter what it is. The only way to fight, <clears throat> you know, because we struggle with alcohol, we're going to look at that. But then once you get out of the control of alcohol, then there's a bunch of other controlling, contributing factors as well that you can get caught up into. And those will be just as detrimental as the alcohol itself in the long run. So what we're doing is this. Okay, <clears throat> we bring a different ball game to the surface when we're looking at recovery. People that don't want to drink, um, try not to kill themselves, this, that, and the other. Well, we had to find out and uh, through recovery, four step talks about doing an inventory. And we ain't never taught that in school or anything, and doing an, doing an inventory of oneself. It's crazy. With all these people with all this money and all this, they they know that business, buddy, inside and out. They know that computer. They know it all. They just don't know that this is a business. They don't know that. They have no idea that, that it's the same concept. You know, in, de in determining... What we put in is going to dictate on how we're going to think, how we're going to react, the impulses and all this different stuff, because then you get into real physics. The word physics means physical. That's it, the anatomy. Alchemical just means your, it means your anatomy. That's what alchemical means. So what we're doing is now is... I'm trying to... Talk to the different levels of brains. Depending on where you are on this scale of materialism in the world. You know, because to the ones who say I'm just crazy, that is, you know, paying attention right now. Okay, let's say you get rid of the alcohol, then you got to watch out for these. You know, but then you'll say this. Well, yeah, if I'm off that, I need these. You need, because what? Listen. <clears throat> okay, the more that we do not know our, who we are, then the more they can get away with putting that in us. And it's still not what the brain is made of. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, you don't. It's, it's designed to keep you in a funk. Those, anything in here has nothing to do with this right here at all. Okay? And I did it like a piece of paper because some people, they can pay attention to it better. All right? What? pushed more than anything. All of them are. They're all pushed. And listen, I know some of y'all are just like, where's he getting at? And it's like, I have no idea, but just go along with this because it's going to help you out. This is a matrix. It's what it is. People laugh and it's like, it's, <laughs> it's, it's what it is. <laughs> Truthfully, this is a piece of paper because this is what I envisioned how this all got started in a board meeting a long time ago with the world controllers. And literally it was on a piece of paper. And, uh, New World Order is nothing new. It's just order of the ages. 
it has to do with the zodiac. And this comes from it, so we'll just say that's the 12 constellations. Well, uh, we were in uh, Pisces, now we're going into Aquarius, so that's all that has to do. That was just a quick bonus. But back to this right here. That's the whole thing is, is you're not supposed to quit drinking. I did a video on that. And see, here in the society, you just go get pills. If you're going to quit and do the psychological thing, well, oh, it's school, don't listen to him. No, shut up, this is stupid. The people that get the diseases go to the doctors and get medications for the shit that they're eating. And drinking that's causing the disease to begin with. Do you understand what I'm saying? So an alcoholic goes and they get medication. I can't remember what it is they tried to give me forever. It didn't fucking work. Do you understand what I'm saying? It got worse. Whatever they gave me, it didn't fucking work. We're working on nine years next month against the whole industry, everything, all this. And then my whole point is, is you got to get out of it. It's a matrix. So <laughs> sitting there and doing nothing, which causes all kinds of health problems. Yeah. And then you tie in all this, these chemicals that people consume every day, all day long. And they go get pills only to get worse the same way that an alcoholic gets worse as much medication. How many of y'all, if it was working, then why it and they're a 95% success rate? Instead of, there's only a 5% success rate in recovery. Does that make sense? And that ain't never addressed. Do you know what I mean? It's just a repeat. It's these people think in their head they're just getting better and they're not. It's just getting worse. They can give them higher dosages. But in the long run, they succumb the same way that the alcoholic's body succumbs to destroying the... this. Listen, this is a motor. You got to learn how to build, and it's a house. Are you going to build the house with material that's shit? Well, that's all that. These cell salts, people have made fun of me about, it's like that's the material. You need to know the 12 systems of the body and the 12 cell salts. You need to know the gems, the stones, and everything, the elements, all of it. That's what you are. Doo-doo Disneyland right there. So just because you get out of this... You still in the New World Order agenda? Conspiracy theory land, it's what you'll say and all that. Not until you get, you, listen. It's like whenever I was in Penfield, I think in Georgia, I had a dream or I had a vision and it was my daughter. And she came to me on the clouds and long story short, she said she wanted me to be free. And it was like, so long story short, it wasn't just free from that. It was free from this whole system eventually to, if you can only close your eyes for a minute and it's like we all have these, we all have these jackets of these cloaks, these cloak of darkness that we've acquired through our lifetime, through what we've seen, what we've listened to that has just crept into our subconscious. And it's called Satan, evil, whatever it is that you feel like it's called, it's what it is. And it's in there. And you gotta, you gotta clean all that out. And it's layered, dude. It's so layered. If you could just see the layers on you and all that anger and all that just nasty worldly emotions is so much weight. And each day we have to learn how to just shed another layer, another layer, another layer, another layer. And it is fucking hard. Because anger is a man, it's a worldly emotion. 
and see <clears throat> what causes anger. Uh, uh, yeah. You understand the ones that control it? Think about not even the anger, but the emotions of the functional alcoholic that, that carries over every night for a lifetime with whatever family unit it is. It doesn't matter. That shit right there still controlled it. Think about where that family unit would be even though the whole fucking gene line or the, the whole century has basically been designed around alcohol. Even though everybody else is prosperous or whatever, it's flourished. Take that away and it would be even more. And you don't see that. That's what I'm saying. These foods and drinks and chemicals, even these, they create an impulse in here to keep you the just... And see, this one you got to tie in the cell towers because you're made of trillions of cells. And see, all the, these chemicals in here control the cells in you now from the cell towers. They can program you through this to do whatever it is they want you to do. Because all these are running this. Not you looking up or eating anything natural. Look, this is lavender. I brought some in today. Oh, this. That's not, it's like we, every classroom should be full of I mean, that's so, it's, God Almighty, it's like, oh, it smells so good. No, you need cologne, you need perfume, you need all this. Can, can you drink it? Whatever it is that we wash and clean and do anything with, and the question is this, and I'll end on this, can you drink it? No, you cannot. I can drink that. I can break that down and put it in a smoothie and now the properties of that, which is magnetic, goes into me. You got to think about it. Everybody in this category right here, every day, that's them. I'll have almost nine years against this. I haven't drank soda in like 35 years. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Now my sugar intake ain't the greatest right now and it's almost nine years on that. So, you know, and and I didn't even start drinking coffee until probably two or three years ago. And I was telling somebody and I said, dude, I'm telling you, it's so powerful. And it's not like I drink coffee um, because some things that I do keeps me part of this world some. Because if I actually cut everything inside... Everybody look at me like I'm the... Because they already say I'm crazy. Everywhere you go, who's crazy? He's crazy. He's insane. It's like, just listen. And it's like, but this would be a plan. And then just from this is what you have. And then throw fake money in there and careers and all that. And you got it. And prisons and banks and universities and colleges and towns and plants, plantations, fucking attractions. Hotels, gas stations, highways, road shit. All from one fucking piece of paper. And all from some very fucking evil people sitting there going, what can we do? What can we do? And it's funny how we're going back through history and looking at what you've done. And then we're actually talking about what you did and continue well to do. <laughs> but there is so much power in this video right here if they could only fucking understand 2% of it. But they can't because it's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Because I just gave it to you. Hopefully you can see that you are. You're in a matrix. All of this is from very evil people that knew what they were doing when they set it up. From one fucking piece of paper in a board meeting. Love you.